go <laughs> go now. Hello everyone, we're here this evening at Anderson Medical Spa and we're going to be demonstrating the Voluderm treatment. Um, it's one of our newer treatments which we're really excited to have on board and one that you can do individually per monthly or you can do in a series which is recommended um, four to six weeks apart um, to allow for cell rejuvenation. There are so many benefits with this treatment. One being obviously texture and pore size and pigmentation, even with vascularity, uh, given the option to. Hold on. Hold on. Okay, you're good. Go. To do a PRP, which is where we draw the individual's blood and spin it down and get the plasma off the top, which is live stem cell. So after this treatment, after we've created all these micro injuries in, into the tissue, we apply the PRP topically and it regenerates the new skin. Because all a stem cell is, is an undefined cell and wherever it's placed, it creates whatever its environment, it adapts to that environment. So uh, we're gonna be demonstrating with Tamara today, who's our lovely trooper. And um, if you have any questions, please feel free to ask me. I hope I have answered. Um, there's some minimal discomfort with this treatment. She has numbed for about 30 minutes, which is what we will do with each patient when you come in. Um, let's see, I'm thinking downtime, minimal if any, maybe um, some swelling. We do recommend taking an antihistamine like a Zyrtec or a Benadryl, not if you're driving, but definitely can help post-treatment. And the redness, usually 24, 36, 24, 36, maybe two, uh, two days of redness, but you can wear um, all natural makeup to cover that up um, post-procedure. So really really wonderful treatment, especially if you're going to see great results without the downtime. So if you have any questions, please shout out to me. I'd love to answer them and, and be available to you while we're doing it. Okay? So we're going to begin. You ready, Ms. Tamara? Mm -hmm. What this That's treatment great. also has which I didn't tell, so there's lots of microneedling out there that you can take advantage of treatments at different spas, med spas, doctor's offices. But this one is attached to a laser. So with that, you're getting, with this particular luminous machine, radio frequency with this treatment. So not only is it helping textural improvement, you're also getting toning and firming. So imagine that for the neck and for the decollete, just those wrinkles lifting and toning and firming that tissue. So you're getting just wonderful benefits all over across the board. Doing okay, Tamara? What's your pain level right now? It's a one, she said, everybody. So that's pretty awesome for her. <laughs> all us girls, they're a little skittish sometimes. Any questions out there so far? No. Kath uh, Catherine's our only viewer right now. Okay. Oh, wait. Hi, Catherine. Well, we have a few. One thing I thought of with the PRP, when you apply that topically post-treatment, it's best to keep it on as long as you can that day and into the evening. You can rinse it off when you cleanse that night. So don't plan on anything that evening going into the next day just fine the next day, but um, we'd like for you to keep that plasma on as long as possible. Jana, how many needles are on the on the tip? I believe one, two, thirty-six. Yes, thirty-six. How's this side built, That's pretty good. It's got a little bit. A little bit. Less numb. Mm -hmm. You're doing right. So we're basically doing, we'll do two passes with Tamara with most patients, and then we'll isolate, you know, whatever target areas you might want to have us focus on, whether it be marionette lines or nasal labial folds around the, you know, around the mouth, very oral lines, which we all have as we get older, you know, whether that's from drinking a straw or um, hereditary 
um, this is amazing for perioral wounds. A lot of people have seen the Kim Kardashian vampire facial, which is this is also called. Um, it's not bloody, okay? So it's clear, the plasma, and you'll see that when I apply it in just a little bit. Okay, around her eye, the crow's feet, I'm going to lower the setting down to low. It was on a medium setting. We can go all the way up to high, depending on the individual patient's, the patient's individual needs. Around the eye, you just want that's a thinner tissue, so you want to kind of be delicate with that. Okay? What's your pain level around the eye camera? Uh, it's about a four. Okay. Still not too bad at all. Tammy asked what she was doing, what procedure. This is Voluderm. It's our microneedling treatment. The microneedling, what I explained, you might have missed it, and we'll just go over that briefly, um, is creating many micro injuries all over the face. So it's almost like a pattern. You know, when you aerate your lawn and you're creating hundreds of holes and damaging the lawn so you get healthy grass to repair and restore itself. That's basically what your skin is doing with this treatment. So you leave some of the healthy skin intact while not dam and damaging some of it so the healthy skin cells will go in and repair what was damaged. Okay on the forehead. Almost done. So someone asked, do you call this a vampire facial or is that something else? We've gone over that just a minute ago. Yes, it can be. There are many names for this treatment, but um, vampire is one of them. Only when you use the PRP, which is the plasma. Mm -hmm. And the reason why, if you look at Kim Kardashian's photos, it just... They did it really aggressively. Like, um, you will have some pinpoint bleeding, but not to the extreme that was what you saw with her. And then the PRP, the plasma, the blood, when you apply it at the end, is what makes it the vampire facial. Because when we draw your blood at the beginning. So I'm going to make her second pass. Um, how are you doing, Tamara? I'm doing good. Good? We're going to keep it at medium. Okay, if we need us to lower it, we can. Yeah, it doesn't 
I usually like to try to do a horizontal and a vertical pass just to kind of cover all those regions in places we might have missed. Jana, there's a lot of different types of microneedling out there. Mm -hmm. So what makes this technology from Luminous different and more beneficial as far as microneedling on the skin? Well, that's a really good question, and I kind of went into that a little bit, but what's amazing about this one, what separates this one attack, um, uh, compared to the other, from the others out there is that the most microneedling um, devices are cordless. So they're just these tiny little handheld devices with not much power, okay? This is attached to a platform laser, so the, the amplification is magnified by just a thousand, I would think, just because of what, you know, what it's creating in the system. So without the, well, not only is it we're doing the microneedling, we're also, we talked about the radio frequency because this system also does um, our radio fre frequency for the body, so it does the toning and firming for the body, so the same system, the same radio frequency is coming through this handpiece, so you're getting the microneedling benefit, but you're also getting the lifting or toning and firming benefit. So that's what sets this one apart. Tammy asks, how long does this take and how much does it usually cost? Um, it takes 30 minutes to numb and 20 to, you know, I would say full hour for, from beginning to end. Um, from the time we uh, draw your blood and get you numb and then the procedure itself takes 30 minutes. Um, it's 400 for one treatment and 1050 for three. So if you do the series, you're kind of getting a, a good deal. And then how okay. much extra is the PRP? And $200 to have the PRP on. And that's per treatment. Pretty tolerable treatment with the numbing. We do the benzocaine, tetracaine, topical ointment. Would you say there's a specific age range on this treatment and who it would benefit, or would you say it's a pretty versatile treatment for everyone? I think it's for everyone. Um, Mid 20s, you know, for acne scarring, this is phenomenal. Phenomenal for acne scar, um, all the way up to you know, depending on the skin. Um, I've you know I've treated people, in, uh, little ladies in their late 70s, early 80s, um, but their wrinkles weren't uh, that aggressive. So wrinkles can be deep, but not to the point where you probably benefit more from a a, bl a non-ablative treatment. We have a few new viewers that have jumped on. Mm -hmm. Would you say hi to, to Morgan? Hi, you viewers. To Morgan. To Morgan. <laughs> hi, viewer Morgan. <laughs> Any questions, Morgan? <laughs> He's typing. Maybe? A little, bit more tender. a little bit more, but yeah. still very tolerable. Did you get that? Second pass is a little bit more tender just because we've created those injuries and we're going back over that same area. So it's going to be a little bit more tender, but still very tolerable. You 
would always, if you're interested in filler, I would always recommend doing the series of the microneedling before you did your filler. Um, and just great results with that combination. Um, you'd inject through your cheeks or whatever concerns, and we'd love to see the results with the, you know, long-term result with the microneedling, and then come back and do the fillers post-treatment. Could you pair this treatment with another treatment in the office? Yes, it's wonderful for photofacial. So we do the rejuvenating photofacial, which is an and minimal, if any, really no discomfort. It's more of a rejuvenation to heat the dermal layer of the tissue so you'd have even better results with the microneedling. Does that speed up the healing process or does it just benefit the general it just outcome? Benefits the, the general outcome. The PRP speeds up the, the healing process. questions out there, guys? I don't have any right now. You can see a little bit of, a little bit of redness and the grid pattern starting to form. Mm -hmm. yeah, it's starting to have the sensation of like a mild summer. And that's what you'll notice it will feel like. It's just that mild summer after the numbing wears off. You want to make sure you're doing treatments for to that area as well for the best result. Tammy asked if this would help get rid of the bags under the eyes. Um, I don't think it will get rid of them, no. It can help with the wrinkles around the eyes, but as far as that, it, it, depending on the, the appearance of them, um, that would be something I believe Dr. Anderson would address. Would it help with dark circles under the eyes? It can. I believe the PRP helps address that especially with how close we're getting to that area. So I'm going to go grab the plasma and you'll, um, you'll see me get that out of the centrifuge. Come at me, open it. <laughs> so as you can see, it is separated from the blood. So we'll take these are your stem cells. So we'll take this and apply it with the syringe onto Tamara's tissue just by um, gently um, little droplets and just spreading it onto it topically because we have created all those injuries in the tissue. It's just going to basically rewinding 3% of our product that we apply every day, all men and women, gets through. 3%. That's not very much. So imagine creating this open pathway 
to allow anything that you put on topically to penetrate where it needs to go, and it's actually penetrating. So this is stem cell, so the rejuvenation is incredible with this, with this treatment. And there are no needles involved in this other than obviously the treatment. So I'll just take this. We're going to just draw it up. Real simple. Can you feel that, Tamara? Yeah, it has kind of a cooling effect. As you can see, it's clear. So it'll just feel really, a lot of everyone, every woman that I've treated loves it because it makes the skin feel really tight. So, you know, we, we love that tight feeling. It's helping to take away the feeling of the sunburn, too. So, again, this helps cut down the healing time. Even though there's not, a lot of downtime with this treatment, it can help. So she'll just leave it as on, on as long as she can this evening, and then just cleanse it off, and she goes to bed. What will she do as far as aftercare goes? Um, we recommend the Neocutis Bio Serum and Bio Cream because you're going to feel really dry. And the, PR, um, the, the Bio Serum has PSP technology, which is stem cell technology as well. So that's really exciting. So just to take that to the next level, we just recommend that post, those post-care treatments. She's all finished. Mm -hmm. um, once again, you can visit our website or call um, up here to Anderson Medical Spa or Webford Medical Spa. Um, we'd be happy to answer any of your questions or um, even on the Facebook or the website. We're always here and available for you. So once again, this is called the Voluderm with the Legend, the Legend Treatment Voluderm Microneedling. And you can do the PRP with it or you can choose not to and you still get great results as well. So thank you and have a wonderful evening. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you.